You know, I just can't believe how lucky we are today. This is a beautiful place that I have passed a zillion times since I've lived in this area, which <laughs> by a lot of standards, not very long. I've only been here about 10 years and I've always been captivated by the structures and I parked my car in a probably dangerous place and two sweet people said, can I help you? And, and so tell us about this structure, this first one over here. Let's walk toward it. It's a, it's a cedar house and my granddaddy moved it from the top of the mountain and put a concrete floor in it for my grandmother to wash clothes in. Oh. Had an old ringer type washing machine originally in it. About how long ago was that? Oh, any gosh. idea? I don't have any idea. And then this next structure? That's an old chicken house and used to uh, have laying hens in it and also used to have uh, raised chickens, about 200, 250 of them every year. And then we'd, all the family would get together every year after they got old enough and we'd have a big chicken killer. Oh my goodness. I won't, I won't ask you the details about <laughs> that. And, and then there's a structure we can walk around or maybe come, let's, let's yeah, do you mind walking right now? No. I hope y'all can feel the beauty of this day. It is high noon and it is warm. We've had a lot of humidity in this area lately, but today is uh, down from what it has been, if, if we could all believe that. Tell us tell us about this. The old car shed, that's what my granddaddy kept his car in, and that's where he parked the vehicle, and it really just originally came off the road, and that's the only place you could park that there, because we would have, it was all yard. Yeah, all this was yard. Uh -huh. had pastures, and he originally out there in the pasture raised hogs and dairy cows. It was originally a, a dairy farm. And a guy in a horse and wagon would come by and pick up the milk twice oh. a day. This is real living, folks. Let me see if I can. I can't get further back without getting into the dangerous little bit road. But this has been such a treat, and thank you so much for introducing us to your family history, and um, we'll talk again soon. Okay.